my best time of 1 minute 59 seconds 0.349 is about 4 seconds off of those Hamilton time, Hamilton's time. But it's reasonable to conclude that he would be faster. 4 seconds faster probably, I don't know. But if that is legit, right, I can't even comprehend how to go 4 seconds faster. And onto the replay. These load times takes pretty long time. I'm looking forward to GT7. The old career mode being brought back. Oh, here we go. Change the view. So you can see the gears. This is the culmination of about a half hour of attempts of a single lap hot lapping. You can't do consecutive laps, so it's hard to get into a rhythm. And I am using a controller, so there's a handicap there. But like I said, it's reasonable to conclude that Lewis Hamilton would be four seconds faster. I was going to count the corners. I'll count the corners next time. I'm going to play the replay again. Just uh, do some math of how many corners and um, divide that by the difference, or divide the difference by the number of corners. Which is, I'm just going to round up to four. Just to see how many tenths per corner and I'm even going to count this past corner, even though there's probably not much time to be gained here. How many tenths per corner I would have to improve to match Lewis Hamilton's time. And I'm about three seconds off, or 3.3 seconds off the gold time. And that was the lap. Hopefully uh, I can play that again. Different view this time. Get my calculator ready. Can't wait to get a PS5. Here we go. Okay. Leave it in this view. I'm going to count silently because it'll be get, uh, getting kind of annoying hear me counting up to whatever corner numbers there are. I'm counting this section of separate corners.
the chicane, I'm going to count as one corner because there's one acceleration zone. Fourteen corners. So four divided by fourteen, and then times sixty. That's four seconds. Is that right? No, no, no. Four divided by. Okay, I'm really bad at math. I've proven that that point uh, through throughout my videos. Let's see. So four divided by fourteen is 2.857 so on. Is that accurate? Right there. Do I have to do any more math? I think that's accurate. So I need about three tenths per corner. Yes. Three tenths of a second per corner to improve my time, which is not completely on the limit. I could probably gain another two tenths, maybe even three tenths, get into the 58s. Um, but yeah, th three tenths per corner of all 14 corners, how much faster that would be to accelerate out of the turns. I'm, I'm assuming he's probably not going that, or gaining that time mid corner, because that would be a major discrepancy in speed difference at mid corner. So he's probably gaining that time on the brakes and on the exit. So, um, yeah, so about uh, 1.5, 1. 1. or sorry, 0.15 hundredths on the brakes and then 1.15 hundredths on acceleration per corner. Maybe that's doable. I, like I don't see myself gaining doing that. Like I said, I could I could see maybe three tenths. But like I said, it's reasonable to conclude Lewis Hamilton would be four seconds faster. But I'm just saying that that's a lot of time. I mean, I, I'm I, on my console. I'm not doing that. <laughs> I, I just don't see it happening. And that's the conclusion of this video. Till the next one.